Hello again. Being the contracting and sales manager, for me, it is crucial to control the execution of the allotments, the overbooking and the availability of the property. During the season I need accurate information about the contingent of the different tour operators, the declared booking positions and the actual rooming lists. I want to show you how our software helped me in this regard. When I need summarized information about expected bookings, or if I want to try out different scenarios, there is the occupancy forecast screen. It is probably the function that I, as the contracting manager, use most. It gives information about the rooms available for sale for a specified period day by day. I use the filters here to include or exclude different elements of the forecast allotments, booking positions, occupied and blocked rooms, and rooming lists with different confirmation status, confirmed, tentative or waiting. The number of available rooms, is calculated by subtracting all the selected elements, from the total capacity of the property. For example, the system can show me how many free rooms there are for certain days, or a period, by taking into account the confirmed rooming lists and the out of order rooms. Then I can add the unused booking positions to the forecast. That is expected bookings, for which no rooming list has been received yet. This would show how many free rooms there would be if all expectancies were confirmed. In a similar way, I can check the remaining availability in case all tour operators demanded the unused allotments whose release periods have not expired. We can also check the occupancy of the property per room types, or for a selected tour operator, as well as compare the information to previous periods. The information we need, can be drawn with just a few clicks, and depending on the need we can specify how detailed it should be. The summary view helps estimate the overall occupancy, and the possibility to accept bookings, above the allotment, or for physically overbooked room types. So in the peak of the season for example, we can see that although there are no free rooms of a certain type, we can offer a free upgrade to a higher class room, of which there is enough availability. Or, we could accept bookings, above the allotment of a tour operator, since that of another is unused. This helps us sell more and find ways out of difficult situations, which traditionally occur in high seasons. The information can also easily be compared to that from previous years, which can serve as a basis of the occupancy forecast. We can also compare the current booking pace, to that of previous weeks, months or seasons. I can always check, if the bookings for the high season this year, are the same, or less, than those for the high season, received at the same moment the previous year. This gives me enough time, to find alternative sales channels, or announce more promotions. This is how our clock evo, helps us plan, control and optimize the occupancy of our resort, and maximize our revenue.